Hey folks, uh, we're back. It's Pete and Andy from Inverarity 121 and the Perfect Sip channel on YouTube. On YouTube. Yay. Hey, hey, happy new year, everybody. Uh, we're going to start with a whole new year of lovely reviews. Gin. Today we're starting with uh, gin. More gin. We've always done many gin reviews, but that's because it's such a growth spirit. We've got some of these new amazing stuff in. The one that we're going to start with for the review is the Bulldog. Uh, now we've fallen in love with this one, it's got a lovely dog collar that you can see up there. Uh, it was released in the Chinese Year of the Dog, which partly inspired its name. Also the fact it's got such a huge amount of different <clears throat> botanics in it, uh, with including stuff like lotus leaf lychees and dragon eye. Does dragon eye not improve vitality and sexual stamina? <laughs> so, uh, as well as the Bulldog, uh, Bruckman's. This is uh, an English gin, uh, it is quite unusual. Um, the uh, predominant flavours uh, that I get are kind of blueberry, blackberry, so it's that real kind of red fruity way, which is unusual for a gin, but beautifully balanced, unusual and very, very cool. Uh, good with tonic, also good with elderflower pressy. Hey, and also from England is the Sipsmith, uh, named after a wordsmith as someone who loves to play with words, a Sipsmith is someone who likes to sip. Uh, made in London in a lovely big copper still called Prudence. Mm. And from France. Uh, Citadel. Now this is unusual, this is strange gin. Um, it's actually made in the cognac region and it's matured in cognac casks, uh, which does take away some of the normal uh, kind of gin flavours that you'd expect. So there's less of the citrus notes in there, uh, but it's so aromatic and there's so many flavours. Uh, 19 different botanicals, triple distilled, and the botanicals are coming from all over the world. I mean, we're talking Mexico, Indo, China, Spain, everywhere. Now, this is actually a very popular gin in Spain, and we're going to try and make it just as popular in Glasgow. So, gins! Gins! 2013! Come and have some gin. Gin is the future.